All right. Well, here, let me let me share let me share the little bit of Star Wars news yeah, we've what do you got? got here. Okay. This is uh being reported from Christian Harloff, right? Of uh Collider. Okay. Right. Shout out, follows as on TikTok. Let's go. Uh, Christian, let's um, go. Let's, let's collaborate. He, he's he's saying that there is a Cameron Monaghan Star Wars live action Cal Kestis Disney series plus and Disney Plus series in the works. This is today. He's saying he's hearing from his sources. That there is a Cal Kestis Disney Plus series in the works. Okay, so a live action thing. Now that would mean then all is well Post in the Jedi Jedi Survivor. Yeah, that that will will discover a lot of stuff in the Jedi Survivor series. You know what? I actually think it'd be great. I think it would be great. I didn't want to say it. it's one of those things like you know how sometimes you hope for something but you don't want to put on the tinfoil cap all the time and say yeah give me this give me this give me this right. give me that. This is one of those things that I feel like they have the actor they've built this up they've they've done stuff. I mean as Matt said even though we don't like it in episode four they've made a direct reference to Cal Kestis and him uh you know kind of kind of uh in what would infiltrating uh the base right. there episode right. four of the kenobi series not uh, yeah sorry, episode sorry episode four. Four. i know yeah. i know yeah yeah, yeah 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 they've really thrown us off with that now i feel like i have to really you know i gotta be careful uh, i actually someone's asked me today like are there names for these episodes no no it's just episode right. that in the kenobi series but that's interesting news you know because now you could have reva go join up you have a, you have something she could do right roken can actually come back and have a per like i don't see Ro like roken and and reva and other members showing back up in uh, an Obi-Wan season two. If they didn't need uh, like a season two, I just don't see those guys showing up unless he literally goes back and starts starts working with the path, which is fine. That's that's that could be its thing. But if you wanted to bring Cal Kestis in now, you could kind of have them show up in a Cal Kestis thing flat out. I actually thought today when Roken delivered that line like that, he said, I'm just getting started. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. Which means he's in more stuff. And I thought, well, what's he in? And all I could really think of was Obi-Wan season two, but I'm trying to think of how that works. So if if um, Christian is right and we are getting a gosh and we're getting, you know, this this sort of uh, Cal Kestis standalone, that's sick. I feel like that's where he would be. You know what I mean? He's going to yeah. have he's going to have his own sort of uh, uh, cast members there and. It, it works because they're both working with force sensitive children, Jedi survivors. He himself is a survivor of Order 66. And that's um, that's fitting. Yeah, I just um, man, I just don't know, because as an actor, like in all honesty, Jedi Fallen Order is probably his like biggest. Well, he was in the, my only know, what's he in? my only my only criticism of him is he was in Gotham. OK, and, and he's like he's like the Joker in gotham and yeah part of it is the script and like the script is just like really i think gotham and i'm like about the biggest batman fan you'll find like the first season of gotham was awesome i think it goes straight downhill from there right. uh like the final season i think like sucks to be entirely honest and i don't know so it's hard because that's like an ultra specific role but that's really like other than that he's like one of these people who's just in, he's like an episode well, actor. yeah you know but he's I mean? pretty shameless though he's a he's a main actor in, in shame i've watched shameless quite a bit he's he's the brother um in that he's in a yeah. lot yeah, he's, he I plays. Guess, a gay, I guess he's I, a gay I've brother. Never, I've never seen it, so I don't know. I don't know if it's good or not. But that's sick. It's, I, it's won it's, numerous awards. Yeah, it's it's a it's a good show. Uh, it's been running from 2011 to to 2021. Is he still in that? Is that still going? It says recur it says it says recurring role. So maybe. Wow, that's the one I, mean, I know him from though. I actually didn't know him from, okay. from Gotham. I only know him from, from right. Shameless. The other stuff I don't know, like Malcolm in the Middle. Right. I'm not sure if he has like a big role. It says in that. He's, in, it says he's in like six episodes, but everything right. else is like an episode here and there. But I mean, obviously, he's great in Jedi Fallen Order, but that's a a video game and it's also like your lines actually are really condensed because it's a video game so you're not you're only acting in a little bit of yeah of stuff i guess it, it's it's probably unfair to judge him as playing the joker because the joker is an incredibly hard role to do and i mean it's like how do how are you one the you know how can you play the joker and then also be in star wars oh wait right yeah mark, hamill. mark hamill does it and let's go the best and he's the best joker let's go uh and he's the best character in star wars yeah, so yeah, uh, okay so maybe there. so maybe you can okay <laughs> like maybe that's what i'm saying oh my god there's already a precedent for that right right yeah 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 that's, that's actually funny <laughs> so i see i've never seen him in god i need to go like check out Gotham. gotham is man it's just not i don't know like season is one is uh no it was on fox oh okay 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 Okay. Yeah, season one was like really good. Like season, I thought season one was like really good. Okay, I have not seen Shameless. I don't even know what it is, so I apologize. Maybe he's amazing in there. Yeah, but that's why I said also it's like it's unfair to sort of judge somebody in that because like one, the show isn't very good, and again, I'm like the biggest Batman fan, and as I love CW shows, like we're fine. Oh yeah, them, yeah, yeah. You know, 
Smallville, yeah. Supernatural, so, The Flash. It's hard right. for me to sort of judge him, I guess, by that, by that sort of role. Yeah, it's also yeah, that's yeah. like that's like the hardest character in the world to play too. Oh yeah, for sure. That would be one that, and also you have a lot of you personally being a fan of Batman have all these other Jokers like portrayals right. to kind of stack him up against or whatever, and that that is tough. That is the, whereas I feel like actually with this he could just come in and be his video right. game. He's not. Know, he's not actually. There is no joker in gotham but there's oh okay yeah, okay yeah okay okay yeah, it's the joker yeah ah you spoil it for you know it's all spoiled yeah you don't watch it it's not very good <laughs> jerome he's this he's this jerome character oh uh, okay so okay it's okay. To, it's it's totally it's totally well joker. so i mean would you still though be i mean excited for it to like if if uh if they if yeah they, i would still be i would i would still be excited for, i just don't know that he's i just don't know that like yeah, he's he's totally the Joker. You he's know? totally Joker. Yeah, yeah. And it's like the it's just like the costuming's bad. There's so much wrong with it. Yeah, yeah. I guess I don't know. I guess I don't know how big. I guess I don't know how big Shameless is because I'm unfamiliar with it. But I guess is like is you know are you if you do a Cal Kestis series, is he an actor that people are that people are gonna know that you're gonna be able to carry this thing with? Right. But then I guess you look at you look at Marvel and they like I don't know the I don't know this girl who's playing Miss Marvel, but she got like a brand new thing. Right. I mean, it is an, yeah. an established thing. It should obviously a young actress. Well, and Star um, Wars does that, too, which is a crazy thing. Right? They bring in people that you're like, who is this person? Right. You know? Like tomorrow, like tomorrow, Morrison. I mean, like we know him as Star Wars fans. Right. Right. But like the general audience does, is not like tomorrow. Well, Morrison's not like somebody who jumps off the screen at you as like somebody, you know, in a ton of stuff. I mean, he D is D John Boyega, too, you know, like. All... Yeah, but again, they but again, they were they came into movies that had, you know, what I mean, like yeah. they came into movies that had you had the, your big actors anchoring it with Harrison Ford and everything. Right. Yeah. Yeah. They were. I mean, yeah, yeah they're, they're still. Yeah. The lead. If really what it is is for me. It's Star Wars. Like they're going to. That's right. sort of what brings people. to. Yeah. The you table. need you need you need to find you just you just have to have you have to have another sort of known actor or actress. With, that's what you do in Hollywood. Yeah. With right. Them, yeah. yeah. I mean, like it's like other like it's always sunny in Philadelphia, like that show, for example, like season one, Danny DeVito isn't in it. And they were like, this is good. But like we have for this show to succeed, we right. need to bring in somebody that like everybody right. knows then you attach that name to it that's what uh that's what mandalorian did carl weathers oh okay carl weathers not that pedro yeah. pascal wasn't a known name right i right. mean he, he he but it's like i think he's a more known name than cameron Ryan. yeah i would love to see two what just depending on yeah who who would they build like like building a cast out around around right. that show and figuring out who all would be involved would be kind of kind of interesting to see because i mean like yeah. i don't know much about moses ingram or whatever i haven't seen any heard anything else honestly exactly about, you're right you know yeah but, but like, you and mcgregor can carry a show i mean even if it, oh, even yeah. if this weren't even if it weren't obi-wan i mean and you were just like hey we want to do a, a thing like oh, that yeah. somebody of that le like if you were saying hey we're gonna do a new star wars show like the one that's coming out with jude law we know nothing yeah. about it other than it's jude law okay yeah. sick jude law's huge he's a big yeah, he's, huge. he's a big yeah. he's he's a movie star i don't know that right. cameron monahan is like a movie no no no, no yeah Star no, no, no. Right. yeah 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 he, he's again like you said known in the star wars universe you right? need a, yeah you're gonna you're gonna need you're gonna need another another actor or actress to bring in and right and and have that anchor anchor name yeah i'm excited it's still though i think it's uh it's exciting to think about the what they could do with that and because there's a big question mark that they've raised here with all the Jabeem kids and all this stuff with the path. It's so like, you, where are these kids going? So what's, you put that, that. So you put that show in between, well, Jedi survivor and rebels five. Yeah. So that's yeah. like that. So that's like what? Nine to five, that, that little window right in there. Right. Right. Where you kind of get them set up and out of harm's way when the galactic civil war really kind of takes off and, and the rebellions. Uh, I mean, it's already been full swing when, when rebels starts and stuff, but yeah, you want to really, Get them off off of Palpatine. He knows Saw Gerrera. Yeah, he does. Cause right, because you, you run into Saw Gerrera and, Je and Jedi Fallen Order. Right. Yeah, that's cool. That's interesting. That's that's breaking breaking news right there. Let's go inside. Source. Yeah, it's rumored, but it, I mean, Christian Harlow. I mean, he was with Clyde. I mean, he kind of knows yeah. what he's talking about. So yeah, that's cool.